my hair started to grow and I was like no I found the secret to healthy hair husband hubby how do you feel about me embracing my natural hair like that also really helped me mentally in my journey really guys that helped me mentally that helped my self-esteem that really helped me accepting my texture and saying you know what it is not perfect every day now what do you do to your hair what do you put on your hair why is your hair so healthy why do your hair keep keeps on growing what is uh, hi guys welcome back to my channel i am zelda willemse if you are new thank you for subscribing to my channel please follow me on instagram at curly z's blog or on facebook at curly z's blog so today's video is things you need to start doing to your natural hair enjoy this video if you haven't subscribed yet please 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 subscribe and join the z world join the family man so please watch till the end because at the end i am asking my husband how he feels about my natural hair and that all is gonna happen at the end of the video What do you think of this juicy twist that I just did? I must say, I am very, very, very impressed with how it came out. I kind of knew that it was going to come out like this because I did it. Um, I think like four or five months ago, I did it. Um, and it, it was so amazing. And I just decided, you know what, this morning, you know, I want a different look. I always wear my hair loose and I was thinking you know what why don't I just do that juicy twist this is the juicy twist that I did it's gonna be twist out when I take it out or loosen it but I must say I really 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 love this please comment please tell me what you think of this twist um, do you also like twist out do you also like juicy twist just normal twist would you go out like this you know would you walk in the public like this and i am going to go fetch my um baby at the crest today and i am going with this hairstyle guys because i must say this hairstyle is looking amazing i'm not even gonna loosen it like i i'm really not gonna loosen it while i was doing this hairstyle today i was just thinking about how important important it is to moisturize your hair if you are following me on instagram um curly z's blog or on facebook curly z's blog you would know that i really love moisturizing my hair and the reason why i love moisturizing my hair is because in the beginning of my natural journey even like a year after or i think a year and a half after I just went with the flow I really did not know that moisturizing your hair is important moisturizing your hair is the road to healthy hair moisturizing your hair is the road to shiny glowing healthy hair and I just didn't know that uh, I wasn't serious man I wasn't focused and I wasn't serious um, I was I was natural. I was natural. You know, I knew that I I don't like straightening and blowing my hair anymore. I knew that I really love being wearing my hair that, like this. But I wasn't doing the work. You know, I didn't take care of my hair the way I should have taken care of my hair. But I am glad that I know now, you know, and no one really told me anything i just decided you know what i really need to take care of my hair more i really need to spend time with myself and with my hair more and the more you spend time with your hair the more you learn about your hair you know i feel like you learn more about your hair when you spend time with your hair than someone actually telling you you know this is what you need to do with your hair oh you know you need to do this you need to do that so the one tip that i can give you guys today 
is spend time with your hair invest in your hair and you will see that your hair will start to be glowing and growing and you know shiny you will see that your hair will start to grow and that is also something that i really want just to talk here and there about i don't want this video about i don't want this video to be about how to get your hair to grow but i really want to speak about how important deep conditioning is in your natural journey and what it can do to your hair through my experience and um, just how it can help you in your natural journey the reason why i want to speak about moisturizing your hair in one of the things how you can moisturize in your hair deep conditioning is because i know guys that a lot of you don't do it you don't do it and the reason why i say i know it's because i was one of that naturals that just did not deep condition my hair you know i didn't know how you how important it is to moisturize my hair i didn't know and i think i didn't know because i didn't spend time with my hair so guys deep conditioning in your natural journey is very important if you are starting out just now you know if you are in your transitioning phase start to deep condition your hair you know don't just wash your hair don't just apply conditioner and rinse it off moisturize your hair by deep conditioning your hair you would really see a difference you know that's one of the tips i should actually still do part two of how to go natural but i just want to really share this important tip that made a big 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 difference in my natural journey deep conditioning guys you know ever since i started to do this every single week i really immediately saw a difference after a few months you know my hair started the one thing that i can really say is my hair started to be to become healthy healthy hair you can just see when your hair is healthy you can see you see you're not losing hair you can see that your hair is not giving you any problems with a lot of frizz your hair is not getting ugly split ends yeah there will be split ends here and there because obviously we're not perfect and we don't always look after our hair but it won't be so a lot of split ends to the point where you feel like oh my word like what am i doing to my hair guys deep conditioning my hair really changed the game for me and another tip that i want to say with you today something that not a lot of people do because people think that it's, it's unhealthy and it is you know it's not good for your hair but i really want to share this stuff with you today you can take it or you you don't have to take it if you are scared that it will it will do something to your hair you really don't have to try it out but just try it out guys i just want to say also with you how conditioner help my hair guys the second credit that i want to give is to conditioner conditioner guys it really helped my hair you guys can see me this twist right here no? this is the twist you would think that i have some expensive product or something to keep this twist like this or you know my hair is so glowing what do i have on my hair i know you guys are gonna ask that question but the only thing that i have on my hair right now is conditioner 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 <laughs> guys really i don't have any sp any special product or any special you know thing on my hair i just have conditioner conditioner and i became best friends like guys conditioner really 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 helped my hair it really helped 
me a lot with dry hair conditioner and deep conditioning same whatsapp group <laughs> guys if you don't know by now and if you know me if you follow me you would know that i keep the conditioner on my hair for me that is also another deep conditioning that you can do i know a lot of people don't believe in it um, I know a lot of people feel like, you know, you have to rinse conditioner off and, you know, it's unhealthy. But I must say that for my hair, it really, really helped my hair to grow. Really, guys, like, I wouldn't lie to you. Conditioner, keeping conditioner on my hair for a day or two and then rinsing it off. really guys it really helps my hair a lot people ask me a lot Zelda what do you do to your hair what do you put on your hair why is your hair so healthy why do your hair keep keeps on growing what is happening what is a special product that you're using I am only using conditioner and my husband is actually a witness to say that I only, my husband and my sister, that I only, only, only use conditioner as a leave-in. I decided to use conditioner as a leave-in because I, guys, I was just so confused, you know. I feel like my hair wasn't improving, my hair wasn't growing, um, there was curls here in there, but my hair was just always dry. Do you guys know how I started using conditioner only for my hair? I actually want to tell the story because it's very, very, very interesting. So, I didn't know, like a lot of people, I didn't know that just normal, a normal good conditioner, um, you can leave it on your hair and you don't have to rinse it off like for a day or two like i i didn't know so i was pregnant with my first baby it's still my first baby there's no second baby but i was pregnant with him and we moved from where we used to stay to another place so that my baby can be close to my mom and my grandma because obviously it was going back to work and they needed to be someone who has who that time had to look after my baby so you know what a newborn baby there is a lot of expenses because obviously you know you are not thinking about you anymore you try to cut here in there and just try to you know be there for your baby financially and also my husband but that's not what I wanted to say. What I wanted to say was, I decided, you know what, I would rather invest the money that I am buying, the products that I am buying for my hair, I would rather invest that money into my baby. Because my hair wasn't growing, I didn't see any growth. Or I, obviously your hair keeps on growing, but if you don't look after your hair, it breaks off again so you don't really see the growth. So, um, I was like, you know what, I am, you know, there's a new baby, um, we rather spend that money on the baby than me buying products that's not working in my hair. So, I started to use conditioner for my hair. I still remember, um, I, that time I used Tresemme, it was the Tresemme conditioner that I started to leave on my hair, I didn't rinse it off. And I was like, oh my word, like, you know, I thought it was going to be like, you know, it wasn't going to work for my hair. I thought my hair was not going to respond well to the conditioner, me leaving the conditioner on my hair. But I was wrong, me leaving the conditioner on my hair and rinsing it off the next day or the day after was the best thing that I could do to my hair guys so after tresemme leaving tresemme conditioner on my hair as a leave-in guys my hair started to grow but before my hair started to grow my hair started to become shiny um it was just the the, the hair stra strands was thick my hair started to become very thick my hair started to grow and i was like no i found the secret to healthy hair 
my hair has been really growing I didn't I don't struggle with dry anymore I don't struggle with ugly split ends when I blow out my hair guys that is actually where I can see that Zelda you know you should be proud of yourself you actually looked after your hair also another thing guys that when I blow out my hair obviously after um, seven plus months I can really see if I looked after my hair or if I didn't look after my hair you know I can really see because then I looked at my hair I look at how thick my hair is I look at because I know I know that I don't have naturally thin hair if you have naturally thin hair then it's another story but I know that I don't have naturally thin hair I know ever since I was a young girl um, girly my hair always used to be long and thick so I know that if my hair is not growing the way it should grow and my hair is not shiny um, and glowing and my hair is not growing then I know no girl you are doing something wrong to your hair so that is just something that I had to tell you guys that leaving the conditioner and I'm still leaving the conditioner on now I have it I have just conditioner on my hair now and really it's amazing obviously if you're not used to this if you're not used to leaving conditioner on your hair you know it is it takes a while to get used to because now there's no defining cream there's no giving that um, there is no but that also um that also helped me a lot a lot to accept my texture that helped me a lot to you know see my hair for what it is you know i know that if i only put conditioner on you know that is my hair and i really got to the point gotten to the point of you know being happy about my texture loving my texture um, not wanting it to be more defined than what it is already i really that also really helped me mentally in my journey really guys that helped me mentally that helped my self-esteem that really helped me accepting my texture and saying you know what it is not perfect every day yeah some days it's not some days i just feel like you know what i don't know what's happening today with my hair but accepting it and still loving my texture still feeling you know what like you know i'm giving my a day off i'm giving my hair to do whatever it wants to do today but tomorrow it will be okay again so just mentally also helping you through your journey to just accept and love your hair and for what it is you know sometimes you know you're gonna forget your curling cream at home when you go visit your friend you're gonna forget your defining cream at home when you go to work and you forgot to put it on the morning and then what's gonna happen you know what you're gonna feel oh my word now nah, i just feel like i don't like my hair i don't like my texture you know why did i forget it at home and you're just gonna be so depressed you know you're gonna forget it and then you know so that really really helped me to just love my texture even though i don't use anything to define it and i really got to the point of saying you know what like there's a lot of people using defining creams there's a lot of people using curling creams there's a lot of people using things to define the hair more but i am fine i am okay with that i feel like i don't you know need to do that because of other people i don't feel i need to use what other people are using you know and leaving only conditioner on my hair it is what what is working for me it might not work for everyone it might not work work for you if you try it out you know and if it's not working for you it's also not the end of the world you just have to find what is working for you and i promise you you will find that back to deep conditioning so like i just said guys leaving conditioner on my hair for a day or two is also part of deep conditioning i see it as part of deep conditioning because i don't rinse it off i leave it for a day or two and then i rinse it off that really helped my hair okay guys so i know that it sounds like such a like 
it sounds like work you know when someone say yeah you have to deep condition your hair every once day it sounds like work but honestly guys ever since i am doing it it's really not work now i see it as part of my natural journey it is a part of my was that so guys um i have my husband here and he's not prepared but i just want to ask him something i've never really asked my husband this question i always wanted to ask him i feel like today is the day so husband hubby how do you feel about me embracing my natural hair like i really 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 wanted to ask you this question long time ago honestly because um obviously in the past it was not accepted by um it was not accepted mm -hmm. in relationships with people that i have been in the relationships with oh okay. yeah so um with you it's just so amazing because you are sorry guys about the lighting it's just that it's we shooting under natural light so it comes in sorry about that but like i said it's just so amazing for me that you are you know you always help me and you always support me you support me in my natural journey you always tell me when you know when i need to get, take care of my and you see i'm not so that is amazing for me so how do you really feel about me embracing my natural hair there's nothing more like you know alluring to me if that's the correct word to use um than a person that you with especially you as my wife Mm -hmm. embracing you know how you were uniquely created by god yeah you know, i mean the hair you not straightening your hair it, it just gives me you know the just the more extra you know extra love for you because yeah. it's 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 like you embracing the way you are you don't like you know a lot of people would be beautiful in their own way if they can embrace the way their hair looks it yeah. doesn't matter whether it, whether it's short that's how you were created that's how you should embrace your own yeah. beauty well um i feel really, I, I really feel very blessed um to have someone like you as a mother of my child and you know as as my wife here as well um it, there's nothing alluring than you know um to see someone so passionate about their uniqueness in terms of their beauty um you know you just embracing the way you are like i respect you for that and i love you so much for that that um you just you know embracing your uniqueness um you beautiful just the way you are and i believe that you know most of our sisters and our brothers should know that you know you don't even have to go off track or um being beautiful according to other people's mm. standards mm. husband please tell them what is the only thing that i am using on my hair what do i have on my hair right now is it conditioning but it's yeah, only it is conditioning. yeah it's yeah. only conditioning i'm sorry guys i'm not <laughs> But I you, know that you do yeah, have a specific but, product that you put on. Yeah, like, but you know, what like, is it? It's conditioner, eh? Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, my, it is conditioner. Yeah. <laughs> you don't but know. Now, you yeah, don't know what's is, conditioner. Well, okay, love go. I'm bold here, okay, so I don't love, know. Okay, I think you, if you see the product, you, you, you're gonna know. So please go fetch the product no, and no, you no. see me putting on no, my No, she's hair. using conditioner. That's fine. I'm not gonna be sent. <laughs> to the to just to show you. okay guys yeah, there it's... you have it i only use conditioner and there you have it um that's how he sees my hair okay guys any any f words for um the husbands of of girls or women who are natural or boyfriends um of the women who are natural and because obviously there are people that are not accepting their girlfriends or their wives hey you know they feel like why you know they have to blow it out they have to relax it so what what will you if there was someone today that you can speak to what will you say to that person it's unnecessary just yeah. accept the person the way they are the, the same way you were accepted the way you were you know what yeah. I mean? um you know and just respecting one another i feel like you know there's these more qualities that you can look at you know some someone who can cook you nice food yeah like my wife does someone who Love, loves you i don't do i cook nice yeah you do okay 
<laughs> but you could better than me though. Yeah, anyways, but yeah, just you know well, there is better qualities, yeah. Yeah, there is better qualities. Like the other time when I was telling a friend of mine that, you know, when people were dreaming of having big cars, you know, having you know, um two million houses. Oh, yeah. My only only dream that I had was to have a beautiful family where there's respect, where there's love in the house, where there's no fighting, where there's just mutual respect and loving each other unconditionally, where um, we build, we turn a house into a home where our, our child, our little Ori is going to be raised well with good qualities. Let's say um, if pushes comes to shove, they get involved in an accident. Yeah. That person cannot work, walk anymore. Yeah. Would you still be with them? Yeah. If they cannot see anymore, would you still be with them? If they are sick, if they are like, you know, are brain dead, will you still be besides that bed, you know, knowing that regardless of what's happening, but that's the person that you chose, you know? Yeah, you didn't just choose the, be exactly. the person because of beauty, yeah. but you chose that person because of the way that person is. Yeah, I guess, you know, it's, it's just the level of maturity. The more you grow, the more you start appreciating other things. You see deeper than, you know, the outside. You see, you're more focused on the future. Will this person be, you know, a great, a good parent? Will this person be... A good um, partner do I wanna you know be besides them when it's those last days you know you're not just in for the money you're not just in for the beauty because those things they don't last the fact is they don't last if there is no money anymore would you still stick you know yeah. what I mean? so thank yeah, you husband so. for saying I love you mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. love you too mm -hmm. Okay. You can my go on with your duties. Cheers, everybody. <laughs> I'm out. No, <laughs> Thank you, love. Okay, guys, you heard it from my husband. So, just to close this video up, I really hope that you guys would really invest in your hair. I really hope that you would, after the day, start deep conditioning your hair, start moisturizing your hair. There's so a lot of other things that I can speak about because it's not only deep conditioning um, and putting on conditioner as a living, you know, but there are other things that you can do to moisturize your hair or keep your hair moisturized, which I will share in my video part two on how to go natural yeah guys there is still a part two coming if you didn't watch part one yet please go back on my channel and go watch that video because you won't regret it i am sharing a lot of tips on how to go natural what to do in the beginning of your natural journey and also just helping you mentally man because i feel like this journey it is more mental than it is physical. You need to be mentally prepared, you know, because I know there's a lot of times where you compare yourself to other people in your natural journey. You just feel like you're not good enough in your natural journey. You feel like your hair is just not beautiful. And it's kind of, you know, kind of affecting your self-esteem. It is affecting how you look at yourself, how you see yourself. So it's really more mental than it is physical. So please go watch that video. I will leave it in the um, description box below for you guys to go check it out. So please do. Okay guys, that is all from me and my husband. I just want to thank my husband for saying that kind words. And thank you guys. Guys, I don't know what's happening with this fly. But here is a window right here. So I think that fly just came in here. And wanted to mess up my video. But it's not going to work. But anyway guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. This channel is not going to only be about natural hair but it's gonna be about family it's gonna be about lifestyle it's just gonna be about a little bit of everything and anything so thank you so much guys for subscribing I see we have new subscribers here I really really hope you guys like what you see so far and yeah please go on my page because I will be putting nice photos of this twist maybe i will loosen it also and show you guys the results of the twists 
out so please go on my page at curly z's blog and on instagram at curly z's blog i'm out thank you guys